Hey, starting off the day uh, pretty mild outside. Uh, Brooke commenting early this morning that uh, not nearly as cool as what it has been over the last couple of mornings for her outside. And uh, that's for sure. Most of us right now waking up with temperatures into the 50s. Lots of high thin clouds. That's a live view in Benton. And look at all the colors still showing up in the trees. A lot of leaves coming down right now, but uh, still a lot of those maple trees. A few others uh, really showing those vibrant colors uh, here right now. So a good chance to get outside and enjoy some of those fall colors and a very fall like afternoon on the way. Very warm weather for the early part of November and that warm weather is going to stick with us through the weekend. So we've got at least a few more days of it to enjoy. Enjoy it because uh, next week some big changes on the way. That cold front set to arrive likely on Tuesday night into Wednesday. It's going to bring our next rain chance and uh, likely bring some cooler weather our way by the uh, middle of next week. Few of us have dipped back into the upper 40s this morning, but uh, for the most part, especially in the southern Illinois right now, temperatures are into the lower 50s. Harrisburg, uh, you're at 53 while Benton's currently in 52. Marion's at 48 to the south. Uh, Vienna, you're at 49 to the north. Mount Vernon's currently at 50, uh, 51 as well in Pinckneyville. Further to the south into Mayfield, Kentucky there in Graves County, uh, currently at 52 degrees. Clinton, Kentucky at 49. Tiptonville, Tennessee at 52. And then back into southeast Missouri, a little bit cooler in the parts of the Ozarks there. Zalma down to 44. Van Buren, Missouri currently at 43. Donovan also at 43 degrees. There's the warm air spreading across the middle of the country, and we're not the only ones enjoying it. This extends all the way into the upper Midwest. Uh, Minneapolis right now, morning time temperature into the upper 40s. That is some pretty warm weather for November standards. A high pressure once again stationed along the east coast. It's going to keep that south southwest wind pumping in the warm air. A little weak drop this morning making its way through the middle of the country. A little weak storm system moving through the southern plains. That's what's generating the high clouds around with us. Otherwise, no real weather concerns despite the added cloud cover. No rain expected in our forecast today. Temperatures today into the lower 70s this afternoon and then uh, once again overnight tonight as skies begin to clear out. Temperatures will be a little cooler tomorrow morning. Like uh, going back in the mid to upper 40s for your Friday morning forecast and then Friday afternoon. We're going to jump right back into the lower 70s. A lot more sunshine expected though throughout the day on Friday. So there's all the warmer weather. It has really taken center stage this week across the eastern half of the United States. But by the middle of next week, some big changes on the way as that warmer air gets suppressed to the east coast and then back into the southeast. Cooler air starts to work its way back into the middle of the country, and it's really going to start to feel a little more like November by Wednesday and Thursday of next week. But today, lunchtime temperature upper 60s. Maybe you plan on trying to get outside, grab some lunch outdoors, hit up one of those restaurants that's doing some of that outdoor dining. Great weather for that. 71 degrees this afternoon for a high temperature, lots of thin clouds around. And by tonight, uh, we'll be dropping back into the low to mid 50s by nine. So uh, Dave was talking about grilling a little while ago. Uh, still some pretty nice weather. I know the sunrise or the sunset is so late or so early, but <laughs> 453. I mean, it was dark outside. I was grilling, but 54 degrees by nine will drop back to about 50 by uh, midnight tonight and starting tomorrow morning in the 40s. High temperatures in the low to mid 70s through the weekend. Sunday likely uh, going to be one of the warmest days there. 74 degrees, lots of clouds in the forecast. Monday also in the mid 70s, but there's the cold front. It arrives on Tuesday and behind it, it drops our afternoon highs back into the mid 50s.